ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Universe Mode on Monday Night Raw, where we start off with the Monday Night Messiah, the architect, Seth Rollins. Come out all high and mighty about himself tonight here, ladies and gentlemen. Even though he did lose to Alistair Black last week, Seth Rollins wants another challenge and claimed he was unprepared for Alistair Black. But Seth Rollins has chosen his challenger tonight from anyone. And no one besides the people who are running the entrance theme and the entrance titantrons and Vince McMahon, only they know who Seth Rollins' opponent is tonight. But of Seth Rollins sporting a new gear here tonight, nice and white. Last time I saw that was at Survivor Series where he defeated John Moxley. But I think we should find out who Seth Rollins' opponent is right now. So here we go. Oh. My God. They haven't. Oh, he's here. The wrestling machine. The Olympic gold medalist. Kurt Angle. He's back in WWE. Last time I saw Kurt Angle was after SummerSlam when he faced Reigns in three... Two out of three falls match, and he severely hurt his his spine. But he's back after so long, and he's facing the other third of the Shield, Seth Rollins, tonight here on Raw. Let's get right into the match. Okay, so I've got Seth Rollins for me. Face off against Kurt Angle. And it is underway. Give me a second. Everything's getting trapped within itself. Sorry about that. Anyways, let's get into the matchup here. Kurt Angle, the wrestling machine, versus the Messiah, Seth Rollins. And, oh, trying to go for a body slam, but Kurt Angle reverses. And, oh my god, on the side of the hip. Seth Rollins gets out of it with a drop kick. Picks up Kurt Angle here. Oh, trying to go for a spinning kick. Angle reverses. Seth Rollins reverses. And a sling blade by the Monday Night Messiah, as it clearly says on the side of his trunks. Oh, and an elbow by Seth Rollins. And it looks like Seth Rollins all already going high risk. No. Oh, a moonsault, and it's blocked by Angle. Gets his knees up. Get up, Seth. Oh, and Seth with a punch to the gut. Angle with another punch. Multiple punches, Seth Rollins. And a snap suplex by Kurt Angle. Turns over the Monday Night Messiah. And he's going for a crocodile roll here. Seth Rollins is straight up. Kurt Angle doesn't notice and Seth Rollins drops him on his on the back again. Obviously Kurt Angle has a couple of injuries in his back. So Seth Rollins going wisely here and going for the abdominal stretch. Seth let's go. He picks up the gold medalist. But Kurt Angle with an elbow. Oh Seth Rollins scraping the eyes of Kurt Angle and a drop kick. Kurt Angle rolls to the outside and Seth Rollins just looking down on him. Oh, and Seth Rollins with a jump spin kick there to Kurt Angle, who rolls in position for Seth Rollins to go for a moonsault that finally connects. Seth Rollins with the cover. One, two, kick out by Kurt Angle. Oh, went for a stomp. Seth Rollins tried to go for an overhand. But Kurt Angle got him with the uppercut. And another crocodile roll. Kurt 
Michael turns over Seth Rollins for the cover. One. Kick out by Seth Rollins at one and a half. Oh, submission maneuver to Seth Rollins here. Oh, it ain't submission maneuver. Just a grappling hold. Seth Rollins seems to get out of it with elbows to the head of Kurt Angle. And, oh, trying to go for a signature on Kurt Angle, but Kurt Angle reversed. And Seth Rollins reversed Kurt Angle's signature. And Seth Rollins finally gets it, the schoolboy super kick to the Olympic gold medalist. And Seth Rollins looks like he's charging up his finisher here. Waiting for Angle to get up. Turns him round for the rip cord knee strike. The cover by Seth and it's a rope break. He's dragging the Olympic gold medalist over to the middle of the ring. Covers him from there. One, two, kick out just before the counter two. Oh, standing shooting star. Picks up Angle now, but Angle with a shoulder tackle. Turns over Seth Rollins. No. Kurt up to the top rope. Oh my god, he misses with the moonsault and Seth Rollins able to capitalise on a downed Kurt Angle. As he picks up Kurt Angle. Trying to go for his signature, but Kurt Angle reverses Seth Rollins. Oh, what a close line into the corner. And Kurt Angle just choking Seth Rollins in the corner. Oh, Seth Rollins gets up. Kurt Angle wiping the sweat off his brow. But Seth Rollins takes advantage. And a sling blade to Kurt Angle. He picks up the Olympic gold medalist. Finally gets him for another schoolboy super kick. Seth Rollins just walking around the ring, thinking of what he can do. And Seth calling for Kurt Angle to get up on his feet. Oh, Seth trying to go for the knee strike, but Angle reverses, and Seth reverses Kurt Angle's manoeuvre. Puts Angle into the corner, trying to turn him around. Oh, and Angle misses. Seth Rollins with the advantage here. Goes Angle into the corner. It looks like he's going to take him up to the top rope here. Seth looks tired as hell. But he's going to go for it. He's got Kurt Angle up here. For a superplex. But Seth Rollins rolls through for the Falcon's Arrow. Cover. One. Two. Kick out by Angle. And Angle gets straight up with a German suplex. Looks like Kurt Angle's going to call for it. The angle slam to Seth Rollins. One, two, kick out by Seth Rollins at two and three quarters. Turns around Seth Rollins here, going after the neck of Seth Rollins. Also, we know Seth Rollins' clear weak spot is his knee after it buckled under him when he faced Kane at a live event in Northern Ireland in 2015. But Seth with a middle rope STO. And Seth going up to the top rope once more for a high risk manoeuvre. With an elbow drop missed. And Kurt Angle with the cover. One. Kick out one and a half by the Messiah. Oh, and Seth Rollins gets another boot to the back. If you think this is going to be match of the night, we've still got the main event, Braun Strowman 
versus a new world champion, Jey Uso, for that world championship. On oh, Seth Rollins reverses Kurt Angle. Try to turn it round, Kurt Angle with the reversal. And Seth Rollins with the reversal. And it ends a go to Kurt Angle. Seth Rollins backing up into the corner. Call for Kurt Angle to get to his feet. And a sling blade by Seth Rollins. And up to the top rope once more goes the Messiah. And Seth Rollins with the move salt. To Kurt Angle cover. One, two, kick out by Angle. Seth Rollins here. With another schoolboy super kick to Kurt Angle. And Seth Rollins with a knee to the face of Kurt Angle. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Seth Rollins with a curb stop to Kurt Angle. That was going to be Kurt Angle finished. One, two, three. Seth Rollins finally back on track. Seth Rollins, all he's been doing recently is losing, losing, losing. But tonight, he has defeated the Hall of Famer. The gold medalist, the supreme wrestling machine, Kurt Angle. What a match. Kurt Angle looking disappointed as hell there. But Seth Rollins deserved the win after a brilliant match. Let's get to the next matchup. The next matchup involves the former world champion, the Samoan submission machine, Samoa Joe, who is absolutely pissed after last week. Jey Uso cashing in on Samoa Joe. He shouldn't have done that, trust me, because Samoa Joe is now out on a mission. To destroy everyone. And don't get me wrong, Samoa Joe will get his rematch for that world title. But who will it be against? Braun Strowman? Jey Uso? Or an outside chance, even Roman Reigns could be world champion when Samoa Joe gets his rematch at the Royal Rumble. In a, it will be a triple threat. Lesnar, Joe and the world champion when the time comes. But Samoa Joe had decided to put out a challenge, a friendly one-on-one, -on -one, where Samoa Joe will deliver a 30-minute bloodbath to the Dutch Destroyer. These two have never faced off in this universe mode before. And it will be very unlikely if they do again. After their paths have rarely crossed. It is the United States Champion. Alistair Black. Now this man has been undefeated for quite some time now and has gone on an absolute tear and has held that US Championship and has taken no prisoners the likes of Ricochet and even Seth Rollins heck soon maybe the, the former world champion Samoa Joe will feel will feel the wrath of Alistair Black. Oh Samoa Joe picks up Alistair Black and drops him on his back.
Samoa Joe taking the US Championship. And he's running off with it. Samoa Joe's running off with the United States Championship. Oh, Joe's dropped it. And a belly to belly suplex. Tars the Black. Samoa Joe using the US Championship as a distraction. Getting Black up to the top of the ramp with a belly to belly. Samoa Joe backs up and tries to grab Black. But Alistair Black knows better and drops Samoa Joe on his back. Oh, Samoa Joe. Ooh, dropping the Dutch Destroyer. Where? He stands. Calling for Alistair Black to get up here. It looks like he has. Alistair Black with a reversal. Throws Samoa Joe into the corner. Oh, double knees to the back. Oh, Samoa Joe gets out of harm's way though. Alistair Black joins Joe outside. Oh! Gruesome kick to the gut. And Samoa Joe, oh, with the headbutt. Grabs Alistair Black and into the apron. Kick to the gut of the Dutch Destroyer. Oh, trying to go for a powerbomb to Black. But Alistair Black reverses. And Samoa Joe getting back in the ring along with Alistair Black. And Black with a jumping switch knee. Oh, and a stomp to the arm. And he's just grabbing the arm of Samoa Joe here and contorting it. Oh, just even more pressure on the elbow. But Samoa Joe looks like he's going to get out of it. One punch to the gut is all he needs. Oh, and an STO. Well, Joe waits for Alistair Black to get up, and Black with a punch. Stirring Joe. But Small Joe. Ooh. What? What's Kane doing here? I know Kane wants the US title from Alistair Black, but where is he? There he is! Kane! Picks up Alistair Black with a two-stone pile driver! Two! The Dutch Destroyer! Samoa Joe stirs to his feet, goes for the cover! One! Two! Kick out by Black! Kane has sent a message to Alistair Black here tonight. It looks like the two demons of their own evilness will meet sooner rather than later. But here goes Samoa Joe picking up Alistair Black. Oh, and a power bomb! Catching the ropes. And Samoa Joe going for a combo again to Alistair Black. And a stomp to Black. He picks up the US champion. Oh! Black reverses Joe. Turns him round. But Joe reverses and gets Alistair Black with a German suplex, but he doesn't let it go. And a dragon suplex. He's crossing the arm to Black. And a final suplex to Black. Cover. One. Two. Kick out by Black. Small Joe drags Black a bit away from the ropes. 
Looks like Joe's going up to the top rope. Oh my God, Joe. Joe, don't do it, oh my God. Samoa Joe takes an ultimate fate here. Oh, and a brain buster. Samoa Joe tried to go for Uranani from the top rope. And it did not work. As Alistair Black now calling for the knee to the face of Samoa Joe. And Alistair Black going after the elbow again of Samoa Joe. Can Joe get out of this? Looks like he can. And I'm gonna push to the gut of Alistair Black. And an overhead belly to belly. Oh. Trying to stop down a Black, but Black goes back into the ring. Joe tried to get him outside the ring again, but Joe with a sub forward drop. Oh, Black is up, but Joe with a drop kick sends Black to the outside. And Joe staring down at Black here. Oh, and an Intiguri. Could this be it for Joe? Is this the opportune time? Top rope. And a Uranagi again missed. Alistair Black. Really timing his moments here. And a Black Mass by the United States Champion. One. Two. Kick out by Joe at two and a half. As Alistair Black just sits down looking at the destruction he has done to Samoa Joe. But Joe, not out of the fight yet. Oh, picks up Black. Oh my god, the knees of Alistair Black. Big on Samoa Joe. With a Uranagi. Send Dallas and Black into the corner here. No, Joe. Oh my god, he's brought it back. The muscle buster. To Alistair Black. Pulling out all the stops to beat the US champion. One, two, kick out by Black. Oh, Black is up, but Joe with a drop kick. Black to the outside now. And Joe raising his hand. Self-declared victor. Ooh, and a drop. Just a big boot to Black. And Joe just stomping down on the Dutch destroyer. Oh, Small Joe gets Black with a power bomb, and he picks up Black now. Turns him round. Oh, and a, oh my God, to the back. Oh, Arthur Black going after Joe, but Joe with a reversal, trying to turn Arthur Black around. For a coquina clutch, I would presume. Samoa Joe waited, Alistair Black here. He picks up the Dutch Destroyer. Alistair Black reverses Joe. Oh, and it's just... Oh my god, a brutal knee to Joe. Cover. One. Kick out. Out of black. Goes for it, but Joe gets him. Yet again, stomping down on black. Just right on the face. But Joe... Finally got Black up, but Black with a knee, double knee to the back of the 
to the back of Joe. But Joe gets out. And Black gets the ball with Joe. Back to hurt his elbow, it seems. And Samoa Joe looks like he's going to get out of it. And he does. And he's going to drop Black again on his knees. Oh my God. He's picked up Alistair Black here. Turns him round for the Coquina clutch. And he gets on Black, but Black's breaking out of it. Oh my God. A head butt to the back of the butt in front of Joe's head. As he's dragging Joe to the middle of the ring, turns him round and stomp to the chest of Samoa Joe. Joe gets up and a, oh, black with a crossbody. Also black to the outside at ring with Joe. Oh, dropping him. Go for a tight grip around the neck of Joe. Arthur Black picks up some old Joe. Joe throws him. That's well Joe back into the ring here. Awaits Alistair Black to jump back in. And Joe catches him out of nowhere. Four. The coke in a clutch. Well, Alistair Black tap out to Samoa Joe and he does. Samoa Joe defeats the United States champion after a gruelling match. And obviously an early advantage given to Samoa Joe after Kane delivered a tombstone pile driver to the US champion. But Samoa Joe has proved that he is capable of taking on anyone in re oh no Joe waits for Black to get up off the ropes and a Inziguri he picks up Alistair Black oh with a slap to the face and a Uranagi Samoa Joe is just a very vile bastard right now. Because he wants his world title back. The referee trying to stop Joe, but Black seems to have passed out in the hands of the destructive Samoa Joe. I think we should get straight on with the main event. It is main event time. And it is set for one fall for the World Heavyweight Championship. And out first is the man that defeated Roman Reigns last week for this title match. It was either going to be Reigns or Strowman facing Samoa Joe. But a shock turn of events that has probably got in Braun Strowman's favour. Jey Uso cashes in on Samoa Joe after Goldberg defeats the world champion. And Braun Strowman strolling down to the ring. Confident as ever that this world title will become his. Ross Strowman hadn't had an easy path to this, whilst Jey Uso had to take on an injured Samoa Joe. But out comes the World Heavyweight Champion. Jey Uso. Obviously, Jey Uso did not win the Money in the Bank match, but he won the contract from Dolph Ziggler. 
who has not been seen since that fateful night. And now Jey Uso is World Heavyweight Champion. But tonight he is not alone as he has the company of the special counsel Paul Heyman and his own cousin, the former world champion, Roman Reigns. So here we go. This is the world title match. That was unexpected. I was expecting Small Joe versus Braun Strowman. But it is main event Jey Uso versus Braun Strowman. But up first, weighing 305 pounds. The monster among men. Braun Strowman. And from Florida, weighing in at 210 pounds, the World Heavyweight Champion, Main Event, Jay Uso. Jay Uso taking a good look, because this could be the last time he holds that world title. Especially against someone the size and power of Braun Strowman. And there is the title, ladies and gentlemen. Could this be Jey Uso's title reign over already? Or will he defeat the monster among men? Let the bell ring. If you're wondering, I'm playing as Roman Reigns here. And Jey Uso started off strong against the monster among men. But Strowman reverses. Oh, and just drops Jey Uso to the mat. And Jey Uso with a super kick to the gut. And a nice hit. And strong oh, Strowman. Roman Reigns just shouted out to Jey to get up and kick his ass. But Braun Strowman right now looks like someone whose ass cannot be kicked. Roman Reigns just circling the ring here. But you got to remember, Braun Strowman is the man that Jey Uso needs to worry about. As Jey Uso reversed Braun Strowman with a leg drag. Oh, a kick to the gut again. But Braun Strowman just pushing him off. Oh, Jey Uso with a DDT. Reigns shouting in Heyman's face here. And Jey Uso going up to the top rope. The Strowman is down on the mat. And a elbow drop missed by Jey Uso. And Jey Uso went after the arm to Braun Strowman. But Braun Strowman just chopped his legs from underneath him. Roman Reigns just looking out to the crowd. Putting his arm up. Showing he's still the head off the table. Jey Uso turns around Braun Strowman. And a stomp to the arm of Strowman. He chokes Braun into the corner. Ooh, close line to the back of the neck. Cover one. Kick out at one by Braun. Reigns is just staring at Braun Strowman here. Reigns just talking absolute utter crap. He looks to one of the fans talking crap about him and he's just staring him down. And Strowman hits Jey Uso to the outside. Reigns staring down Strowman. Reigns getting out of the way. Oh, Jey Uso reverses. Yeah, Roman Reigns saying this is what the bloodline is about. Oh, Jey Uso sends Braun Strowman flying with a jawbreaker. 
James Hunt getting back in the ring. Lost Braun Strowman. It's on the outside, but James Hunt breaks the count and a big boot. There's Braun Strowman just pandering to the crowd. Oh my god, just on the chest. Oh, Braun Strowman. Forcefully put James Hunt back into the ring. James Hunt reverses Strowman. Puts him into the corner. Oh. No. Jey Uso is not going to do it. To the outside. With a superplex to the outside. The pain on these two men's faces. And he chucks. He's going to chuck Strowman back into the ring. Reigns just like James will get on with it and he looks like he's going to the top rope for a splash to Braun Strowman and the cover two kick out by Strowman at two Reigns didn't see it now he does and a super kick by Jey Uso to Braun Strowman the cover one Two kick out by Strowman at two. Rob Strowman. Oh, Jey Uso. Another clothesline. Ducks under, and a jumping clothesline by Jey Uso. Oh, Jey Uso. Oh, Strowman with the reversal. Oh, Strowman's picking up Jey Uso now. And dropping him with the Yokozuna cutter. Paul Heyman talking to Reigns right now. In the cover. One. Two. Kick off by Jey Uso. Reigns trying to encourage him to get back in the fight. Oh, Braun with a headbutt to Jey Uso. No, Braun. Could this be it for the world title? Braun Strowman. With a power slam in front of Reigns. Covered by Braun. One, two, three. And Braun Strowman is your new... World Heavyweight Champion. Jey Uso, with a bit more humility than Roman Reigns, shakes the hand of Braun Strowman and picks the hands up of your new World Heavyweight Champion. This is going to make things very interesting going into Royal Rumble. Brock Lesnar, Samoa Joe, Braun Strowman. I have no idea who's going to win out of them three. And I don't know what's going to happen to Roman Reigns and Jey Uso. Could it turn into a five-way, maybe? Who knows? But all we know tonight is that Braun Strowman is World Heavyweight Champion.